Good afternoon, my name's Jim. We have the Ideal Umbrella Stand, and the other product is the Ideal Umbrella Stand in HD for Heavy D. But first, I'd like to show you some of the competing products on the market. This is another umbrella stand. Uh, not a very good quality, very thin materials, and a very poor design. Let me show you. When you install this umbrella stand into the surface, you have to step on each side. The problem with that is if the ground surface is firm, which it frequently is, because you're stepping on one side at a time, the spikes eventually bend and even worse, break off completely. Another competing product is the Sandblaster, I believe it's called. And it, while it works okay at the beach, as I'll demonstrate, requires quite a bit of work. With the ideal umbrella stand, quality is much greater, the welds are much better, thickness of materials, and an ease of use. Simply by putting your lower pole to your umbrella into the stand and tightening the wind restraint, you face the kick plate or foot plate if it's a windy day, the direction the wind is blowing, lower to the ground and simply step on it. After installing the bottom half, simply take your umbrella top and enjoy. Again, with the ideal umbrella stand, it's much easier to use. As I said, you put the lower pole into the stand, tighten the wind restraint, clear away some of the lighter sand and you're and that's all there is to it now I'd like to introduce you to the ideal umbrella stand in HD which stands for heavy duty one of the benefits of this stand is that you're frequently going to encounter different soil conditions, whether it be the beach, the river, the lake, athletic fields, and so on. And while the ideal umbrella stand is adequate for most applications, you're going to come across some where the soil conditions are so hard and firm that you can't even stomp it into the ground, which is the case with any of the ones that you've seen so far. The ideal with the HD model, not the case. Simply hold the spike like you would a hammer and nail, raise up the top half, and hammer it into the ground. It also, once you've got it into the ground, especially if the conditions are firm, they're hard to get out. Not so with the HD, because it reverse hammers. In addition to that, because of its unique design, you can place it at any angle depending on the location of the sun and where you want your shade to fall. Now you've seen me install the HD model into beach conditions, beach type conditions. Now I want to show you it's just as easy in the more firmer uh, athletic field park setting type conditions. Again, holding the spike. done. Now, I admit that this requires some effort, but like the sandblaster unit that I showed you, I believe the effort is less in this unit, and in addition to that, there's nowhere it can't be set up. With a little bit more effort, if the ground conditions are firmer, you can at least still use your umbrella stand. 
To further demonstrate the versatility of the HD version of the Ideal Umbrella Stand, I've set up on a horse trail. The ground is very hard after you get under the first half an inch of loose dirt. And I'll show you, even though it requires a little bit of effort, at least you can get it in the ground. I think you get my point. Regardless of the conditions, beach, river, lake, camping, you're still going to be able to use your umbrella stand.